And in Jackson, three break ins in one hour near Interstate 55. 16 WAPT's Hadass Brown talked to the store's owner. It's a, it's a shame that, you know, a holiday weekend ends up getting ruined by, you know, somebody who doesn't care. A frustrating 4th of July weekend for several Jackson businesses. Just selfish, and it's, it's, it's a shame. It's a shame. Overnight, crooks broke into several stores within one block of I-55. That's what the baseball bat. That's what it looks like to me. Baseball bat. Intruders smashed the glass front door of the Green Oak Garden Center on Canton Mart Road, and when they couldn't get in that way, they threw a rock through the window and shattered it. We worked hard to have a nice place for people to come and shop and do business, and we cultivate relationships, and it just hurts when somebody wants to take advantage of that. This wasn't the only break in early Monday morning. Police say thieves also hit two other businesses just down the street. Those overnight intruders also targeted a monogram shop and a furniture store. Somebody has evidently, you know, been to three or four businesses this morning and done the same thing. So, you know, it's not just us that's that's hurting. Plastic bags. And Employees at the garden center say they're still not sure if anything was taken. At one of the other stores, an employee says the thieves got away with cash. Now police are hoping surveillance can help track down the criminals responsible. Something happens, you say, okay, this is where we are, and we just go forward from here. In Jackson, Hadass Brown, 16 WAPT News. Now, police say they got alarm calls in all three cases between 12:20 and 1:20 this morning. Surveillance video from one of the stores shows a white man who they say could be a suspect. Detectives are investigating whether all three crimes are connected.